Hey you guys and welcome back to Beamer Light. So I'm excited that you guys are here and I have such an encouraging, powerful word to share with you guys. And so let's pray and get right into this word. Father God, we thank you for today. We thank you for your sovereignty. We thank you for your grace. We thank you for the magnitude of who you are. And I pray, Holy Spirit, that you have your way right now in this hour, through this message, through this word, that you will touch many of our hearts, that you will give us a divine and fresh revelation of your word. I pray, Holy Spirit, that you have your way. Pour your spirit over us today. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. So <clears throat> this morning I was sharing with, you know, my group as to how walking with the Lord, there's a vision and the provision he has for our lives. And so I want to share today with many of you guys that walking in the abundance and the grace and the mercies of God, we know zero lack. We don't, we don't know what lack is. And so when you position yourself in a heart posture of obedience and reverence to the Lord, he will start to show you, begin to show you, <laughs> excuse me, his goodness. And so I want to share today something he was placing in my spirit today of knowing no lack, the fruits of your labor, what you've put in, what you've put out, what you've um, prayed, what you've stood in agreement for, what you've been standing in, in the promises of God for and what he's spoken over your life, you're going to reap that. And so he was sharing with me the very fruits of what we've been praying for, right? What we've been praying for, what we've been sowing into, we're reaping it today. And it's so powerful when you see it come to pass. It's so powerful when you taste it, when you discern the glory of God. He calls us to go from glory to glory to glory to glory. You know, he tells us that we are seated in heavenly places. And so we can act like that. We can move like that. We can breathe like that. We can taste and see through the eyes of Christ. And so I'm here, this is a short word, but I'm here to, today to share with you, you are reaping your harvest. You're reaping everything you've you've sowed into. God says, taste the fruits of your labor. Taste the fruits of his kindness. Taste the fruits of his goodness. And he rewards diligently. He tells us that. Seek him with all of your heart and do not lean onto your own or trust him with all of your heart and do not lean onto your own understanding. But in all of your ways, submit to the Lord and he will make your path straight. I love you guys. God bless.